Hi, welcome to Carlitos Kitchen. Today I want to show you something that I just love here from Baja, and it's our Chocolata clams. These clams come from Bahia de Magdalena, which is up north here from Pescadero, probably about two hours north. The beautiful part about it, they show up live. And I want to show you how to chuck them and the complete process of how to eat this clam properly. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna use this bowl to catch some of the ocean water that comes inside the clam, and I'm gonna cut. There's two parts of the clam that hold it together, and it's a little muscle, and it sits in both sides of the clam. So now I'm gonna flip it, and I'm gonna cut that side. See how it opened up? Okay, well, first of all, I wanna get rid of the, and no, that's just salt water from the ocean. Now, I'm gonna use my thumb, and I'm gonna pull it back like that. So I'm cutting the top of the muscle, as you can see there. I'm gonna separate the clam so I can use it maybe later for a little bowl. So now I'm gonna get the other part, and now it's free. First of all, I'm gonna get rid of this part of the clam, which is the belly. That's a part that you don't eat. So we're gonna discard this. I love using a towel all the time, you know, just to absorb the liquid of everything. So we're gonna put this to a side. Now the clam, we're gonna separate what's the adapting muscle, which is that part right there. And then we're doing the other side. We have that part. So now we move, we remove already half of the clam here. Now I'm gonna use a little bit bigger of a knife. We'll cut the clam right in half. See it's moving? <laughs> That's how fresh it is. Anyway, so now we're gonna remove the belly, which is the part I was telling you, we don't eat. And now we're gonna do the other side. Now it's clean, we're gonna wipe the cutting board. Okay, from here, this is one of the most important steps when we wanna eat these clams. And I learned this from the Japanese, actually. So this is just kosher salt, okay? So we're gonna add some salt. See it's moving? because of the salt. So we're gonna add a little bit of water. And we're gonna mix it with the salt. So what we're doing now, we're cleaning and getting rid of any parasites that the clam can have. When I was a kid, we always ate these clams straight out of the shell. Little that I knew there was all kinds of living bacteria inside. But with time, working in the kitchen long enough, you learn a lot of good things. So anyway, back to the clam. Now the, the clams are now being washed and clean in salt. Now I'm gonna put them in a little bit of water. This way I'm gonna get rid of some of the salt inside the clam. From here, I'm gonna show you this, which is very important. I think I'm gonna do it with this towel. I'm gonna put this back in here. And I'm gonna clean it now And from here, I'll show you. I'm just gonna trim it, make it look nice and pretty. This I can just save like this. Now the clam is nice and ready and clean. So I have a bowl of ice water here. So if we grab this and you wanna eat it raw, this is a good moment to let this soak. Remember the salt? We just wash it and clean it on the salt. Well, we're gonna put it in the ice, and it's only been here a few seconds. You saw me when I put them in, and now just from the ice water, this is so nice and firm and crunchy, and that's gonna make the clam taste so much better. So now I'm gonna to move to a paper towel. Put the towel there, and then this paper towel, I'm gonna to set the clam. This way we're gonna get rid of the excess water. Muscle. We'll just press a little bit. So now we have the clam nice and clean. Now all I have to do is clean my shell. This paper towel works perfect for this. I have my other half over here. So now it's nice and clean. I'm going to use this. Actually, I think I'm just gonna use one shell. 
So I'm going to take this clamp, take two cuts on that, put that there. This piece is a little bit smaller, so we'll just cut once. Oh, it's so good. These clamps make me crazy, I'm telling you. It's one of the favorite things since I was a little since I'm a little kid, I love to eat these clams. They're just magnificent. So, here we have the clam. Now we need a little bit of lime juice. And watch what's gonna happen with the clam. Oh, it just moves very, very little now. I think I want a little bit more lime. Well, now all I have to do is add my favorite hot sauce. And just a tiny bit of salt. And here, you have a chocolate clam prepared fresh, nice and clean, just a little bit of lime and a bit of hot sauce. I think I have to try it, my mouth is watering. Oh man, can't help myself, so. Mmm. 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 You know what's amazing? Is these flavors send me right back when I was a little kid. Growing up in La Paz, I had the ocean about two, three blocks from my house. And I was so fortunate as a little kid that I can walk across the street and I, I can walk down to the beach from my house and I can get these clams. They're so delicious. Well, I want to eat this clam, so I'll see you guys next time, and thank you for watching Carlitos Kitchen. My name is Carlos Cham. I'm the chef and owner of Carlitos Place in Pescadero. Have a nice day. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.